Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get started. In this video you will see in which direction the price of Ethereum has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators SMA, Divergence, Stochastic RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the Ethereum hourly time frame, the price moved only slightly to the upside with around 1.3% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 130. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, the current price is between the 20 and the 50 SMA. If the price bounces off the 20 SMA which is currently at 129 it could be seen as a support and the 50 SMA that is at 132 could be seen as a resistance to the upside. Breaking either way signals a possible further move to the corresponding direction. It's important to note that currently the price is below the 200 SMA, which is normally a strong resistance. A potential move upwards, however, could be signaled if it were to break decisively upwards. Looking for divergence in the hourly time frame, there was a bullish divergence and the price already went up. Looking at the hourly stochastic RSI, there are no signs of the stochastic RSI being oversold or overbought at this time. Looking at the hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. Moving to the three hourly simple moving averages, at the moment, the price is between the 100 and the 20 SMA. If the price bounces off the 100 SMA which is currently at 130 it could be seen as a support and the 20 SMA that is at 133 could be perceived as a resistance to the upside. If there were to be a break either way, it means that there could be a continuous move in that direction. For longer price development, the daily time frames should also be considered as the shorter time frames are not as accurate. Jumping to the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but because the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, we can deduce that the trend is currently on the up. Moving to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is below the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the downside but it's expected for the price to remain the same for some time because the MACD histogram shows that the momentum at the moment is shifting upwards. You should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be bullish. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short-term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time.